This is the maiden of the FT Spitfire. Thank you, Kilroy, for this uh, speed build kit. Uh, I'm going to toss it up. I'm balancing it with a uh, 2200 3 cell milliamp battery. I'm just going to check the balance off again just because I'm not quite sure. Yeah, it seems okay. Let's toss it up. Hope for the best. First maiden went okay. I seem to be having a calibration issue. Uh, I realize that whenever I'm sinking in a new uh, receiver, I need to recalibrate the ESCs. Uh, so now, if I recalibrate the ESC here, like I've done with the KFM wing, I will not have to recalibrate it again uh, using the same receiver. Uh, on the same model if I bind the receiver up to a new model I will have to redo the binding uh, the calibration I'm sorry the motor is quite hot the plane seems underpowered which shouldn't be the case this is an, a, a BL Halley motor it should just be enough remember buzz bomb I recommended this motor for you to you for the Spitfire and you were what well, it's gonna be sluggish well you saw it flies it's not um, flying the best, but it's flying. I think that if I recalibrate it, I'll be fine completely. The thing is that I just don't want to take off the prop right now. I kind of messed up. I had everything reversed properly. And then I didn't press the cancel button to save it. So I had to re-reverse re all the channels. Basically all my channels were <laughs> We're needing a reverse. I'm gonna take it up again. This is a big battery. It's a 2200 three cell, has a lot of capacity. Usually one of the batteries that I fly more time on uh, bigger planes. I'm starting to like this type of battery and these these types of planes, as opposed to the Mighty Minis, which were, are great. They taught me how to fly, but I'm just liking these better and I found a way to store all my planes properly. Um, so I'm just going to launch it up again, give it another quick roundabout and then call it a day.
Okay, well, that was the maiden of the Spitfire. I see that my stick holding the power pod came loose, which is no good. I might have to do what uh, J Bix recommended, which is put some fuel tank, uh, which you call it on there. And it's actually a technique that I want to do with all of them. I'm not going to keep on pushing it uh, and keep on flying it, even though I have a decent amount of batteries that can fly this. I'm just going to call it a day with this and call it a day in general. So that next time you see this plane go back up in the air, it's going to be painted and decorated. And it's going to have a different look and feeling to it. And uh, that's it for today, guys. Have a good day.